senses all understanding. Turn your eyes upon Jesus. Look into his wonderful face. And you will be filled by the power and grace of Jesus Christ. Do you have the peace of Christ? Do you have, do you have calmness in your life? Focus on Jesus Christ. He will make a way for you. What is your testimony today? What is your testimony today? Your testimony is Jesus. I can do all things through Jesus Christ who strengthens me. It was Paul who said, I know whom I have believed. And I am persuaded that he is able to keep that which I have committed unto him against that day. All glory to Jesus Christ. All glory to Jesus Christ. All glory to Jesus Christ who strengthens us and gives us victory in our walk for Christ. Psalm 42 verse 7 says, All your waves and breakers have swept over me. So oftentimes in life we feel like we're just overcome by all the waves and the problems of life. It's just like they are relentless. It's one wave right after another. And they come, it seems as though, like waves of problems. Oftentimes these waves are in forms of financial distress. It's one bill after another. It's one problem after another. It's one bill collector after another. And it seems as though is that there's no way out. Oftentimes the waves of life are relentless in forms of illness and it's sickness and uh, health problems and doctors and doctor bills and hospitals and medical emergencies. And you may feel this way in life. It seems as though that the waves of life are just relentless and pouring upon you. The Bible talks about God being our mighty rock. In Psalm 62, verse 7, the psalmist says that God is his mighty rock and that he is his refuge. God is a mighty rock and a mighty refuge. This is a strong pier that I'm standing beside of here today. This pier is made of uh, almost solid concrete. It would take a phenomenal hurricane to take this pier out. Nothing is impossible, of course, but it would take a tremendous wind to take this pier out. It's very strong, made of almost 100% uh, concrete, it appears. And so it's very formidable. And so we could walk on top of this pier, we could stand upon it and feel very secure and stable. But this is nothing in comparison to the stability of God. This is nothing in comparison to the security that we have when we stand on the solid rock of Jesus Christ. On Christ, the solid rock we stand. All other ground is sinking sand. If you're trusting in Jesus Christ to be your Lord and personal Savior, you're standing on the most solid, formidable rock of all. It is a rock that will withstand the waves and the turbulence that oftentimes seem to be unrelenting and always pounding upon the shores of our lives. Put your trust in Jesus Christ today and stand on the great solid rock of Christ. We're living in a world that is desperate for clean, safe drinking water. You may not sense the desperation. You may not have experienced it. But yet, over one billion people on planet Earth are desperate for safe, clean drinking water. Little children are sick and die at an early age because they do not have access to safe drinking water. Mothers in third world countries will spend almost their entire day traveling 10, 15, sometimes 20 miles to carry water back for the children and the family, and then they do not have enough water to drink. Oftentimes, this water that they carry long distances is contaminated, is sewage filled, and yet these children and families are having to drink dirty, contaminated water. We need to help alleviate some of the dirty water that's in the world by providing wells that will provide fresh, safe, clean drinking water. Will you help 
us build a well? Will you help sponsor a well? Will you join with us in helping us to provide safe, clean drinking water to a thirsty world that's searching and hoping that they might have a better life and a better lifestyle? We can help them to have that. We can help them to have the most precious possession that we have Besides the Lord Jesus Christ as our personal Savior, we can help provide fresh, safe drinking water by working together to provide a well. Please call us right now and let us know how you might help. You can make a contribution of any amount, a pledge of any amount, and we'll work together to provide safe, clean drinking water. You can help us build a well in a third world country in Africa. Call us right now. Let us hear from you. 812-858-3920. That's 812-858-3920. And partner with us as we provide safe drinking water to people in third world countries. While in Africa, Carol and I met this family about an hour south of the Zimbabwe border, just outside the village of Dambali. They are fortunate to have access to a wagon and a couple of donkeys. This mother and her children are traveling several miles to haul water back home. This is only one of several trips they will make each day and every day because one wagon load does not provide a family with adequate water for drinking, cooking, and bathing. This family will likely sell and barter their services to transport water for villagers who do not have a wagon or donkeys. This morning I turned on the faucet and took my shower. What about you? Do we realize how privileged we are? Can we understand how little it takes to share life with those who are less fortunate? Our friend and interpreter Takalani is from a community about an hour south of a village we are visiting. She converses with a local woman about the desperate plight of her village. The woman expresses how difficult it is to find a safe, fresh water. Oftentimes, it is impossible. When water can be found, she spends hours each day carrying it back to her home. Some days, she is forced to pay other villagers to haul water for her. Water is not a luxury. It is a necessity. This woman needs water for her family to drink. She needs water in order to cook their meals. She needs water to wash their clothing, to clean her home, and to bathe. She is desperate. Her family is desperate. The village of Dambali is a community of more than 900 people. They are all desperate for water. It will cost about $5,000 to dig a well that will provide safe, fresh water for this entire village. A little further down the road, we had the opportunity to visit with this beautiful African woman and her baby. Many of the women in this area spend the majority of their lives carrying water for their families. Most of their days are consumed with the chore of walking five to 10 miles and further in order to carry 20 or 30 gallons of water to their homes. I can't even imagine how difficult it is to carry a baby in addition to a heavy load of water in oppressive heat over dusty roads in my bare feet each and every day. Frequently, when water is found, it is contaminated. Contaminated water breeds sickness and even death. If we can build a safe, fresh water well in this mother's village, not only will her family be healthier, but thousands of others will be healthier. Children in this village have an uphill battle in life. These beautiful, sweet children deserve an opportunity to grow up healthy, go to school, to dream, and to pursue a fulfilling life. Without water, life as we know it, hygiene, cooking safe meals, and thinking about a future is nearly impossible. When do parents in these villages have time to teach their children about anything other than finding and carrying water? Presently, locating and transporting water is the number one priority of each and every person in these villages. Without safe, fresh water, they could die. 
Each day, these residents spend many hours hauling water just to survive. Help us give the parents of these children a chance to focus on the joys associated with being parents instead of constantly worrying over where they will find water. Give these children life. Give them a chance to dream. Please call us right now at 812-858-3920. Help us build a safe, fresh water well in this village. Your contribution of any amount will go toward building a safe, fresh water well. This well is a contaminated source of water. Some of the villagers have used this well, but it is unsafe. Although the locals are now aware of this, out of sheer desperation, many still utilize this source for water. Recently in a nearby village, the outcome of drinking and utilizing contaminated water was a serious outbreak of cholera. With your help, we can build a safe, fresh water well for the people in this area. Please, we need your help. We can build a well in this village for about $5,000, but we need your contribution to make that happen. Pick up the telephone. Call us now to give safe, fresh water. Your pledge or contribution of any amount is vital to help improve this dire situation. This is a school in Chiriri, a community of approximately 9,000 people. They do not have safe water. Without safe water, the school is unable to provide hot meals for the children, something most of us take for granted. Not far from the school, we came across this local village woman. Each day, she rises and begins her search for water. This day, she walked to this well to see if by chance there was water. There was nothing. There hasn't been any water coming from the well in months, but she was hoping that maybe on this day there might be some water. The well is completely dry. Can you imagine going to the tap in your home and finding that there is no water? Although most of us are unable to imagine their plight, we can do something about it. This village needs a new well to provide the residents with safe, fresh water. With your help, we can dig a new well. Please help us give her and her community a safe, fresh water well. Call us right now at 812-858-3920 and please make your most generous gift. Glenn and I met this beautiful child beside the road with her wheelbarrow and two water jugs. Esther is about seven or eight years old and is trying to locate water for her family. She will push this wheelbarrow several miles in search of water. On a good day, she will return with good water. On a bad day, she may not find water or the water may not be safe. Can you imagine sending your small child out alone in search of water? What an incredible responsibility. We're here outside the community of Benda and we're with uh, Pastor Dr. Maxwell who is um, a graduate of Newburgh Theological Seminary. He's um, one of our new alumnus, and he pastors a, a great church here in this community, in this area. Uh, we're here, uh, right behind us is a, a tremendous uh, village, and there's a tremendous need for fresh, safe water. Uh, and Pastor here is helping us in this project to uh, hopefully in the future bring fresh, safe water to this village. And Pastor, it's so, thank you so much. It's so nice to be with you today. And tell us, what, what's the name of this village? Uh, the name of this village is uh, Makambe. M-A-K-A-M-B-E. And, and how many people do you think live just in this village? Uh, like this is a, a, a new village. It is an extension because people are congested just on top of us here. So possibly the people that are coming here, including those that are already here, will not be less than 5,000. And these people here are having to, uh, they're having to get water elsewhere. They're even ha having to transport it or carry it from other places. And so it's not, not very available, is that correct? Yes, they seriously do not have water. And the rivers that were having some running water have dried up and they have to travel 
to to get water. Sometimes they are they are expected to pay those who have got transport to bring water to them here, and it becomes very difficult because some of these people are seriously needy people. Some of them are the the the, the poor uh, the poor people. Right. Well, thank you very much, Pastor. We appreciate you helping us. And uh, with God's help uh, and us working together, uh, I believe that we can bring some fresh, safe drinking water, uh, a new well to this area. It may take us some time, but if we'll work together, uh, I believe that we can make that happen. Yeah, just like it is indicated in the Bible that uh, Jesus sometimes... <clears throat> is seen as giving water because water stands for life. Yes. And these people, <clears throat> when you give them water, it's like you're giving them life. Yes. To them, nothing happens. Life is incomplete without water. Yes. Because they can't cook their food. They cannot wash their clothes. Even if they were to water some garden for just self-projects for vegetables, they can't do that. So without water is a serious problem. And if... By God's grace, we could make a, a well for them. It will save a lot of people here. Amen. Wonderful. All right. Thank you, Pastor, for being with us today. God bless you. We're praying that it works for you, raising some funds, and uh, how I imagine the joy, the day we finished a project of a well here. Amen. We'll come back and uh, we'll, we'll be here when they, uh, they bring the water out of the ground. We'll come back here and we'll videotape the new well. Yeah, sure. And, and we can show it to all of our people and all of our friends. That's right. Yes, thank you. Thank you. All right. Write to us at Glen Mullet, Safe Fresh Water, Post Office Box 1238, Newburgh, Indiana, 47629. Your most generous gift will help us build safe, fresh water wells for these children, their families, and thousands of others. Water is life. Please use your credit or debit card and make your most generous gift. A contribution of $30, $50, or $100 can help us save the lives of these children. Each and every gift is significant. No gift is too small. Fifty people giving $100 each can build a well. One hundred people giving $50 each can build a well. Five people giving $1,000 each can build a well. Your Sunday school class or Bible study group can sponsor a well. Together we can do something mighty in the name of our Lord. Please call us at 812-858-3920. This little water well is actually providing safe water. However, this single water spigot is the only source of water for a village of over 5,000 people. It's not enough. Can you imagine 5,000 people gathering their drinking, cooking, and bathing water from this single source? We can provide a greater source and supply of water if you will call us now and help. This is wonderful water. Safe, fresh drinking water but it's providing water for a community here of over 5,000 people to get their water from this one source. We need to provide other fresh water sources so that these people can have more resources for this very valuable, safe drinking water. We're living in a world that is desperate for clean, safe drinking water. You may not sense the desperation. You may not have experienced it. But yet, over one billion people on planet Earth are desperate for safe, clean drinking water. Little children are sick and die at an early age because they do not have access to safe drinking water. Mothers in third world countries will spend almost their entire day traveling 10, 15, sometimes 20 miles to carry water back for the children and the family, and then they do not have enough water to drink. Oftentimes, this water that they carry long distances is contaminated, is sewage filled, and yet these children and families are having to drink dirty, contaminated water. We need to help alleviate some of the dirty water that's in the world by providing wells that will provide fresh, safe, clean drinking water. Will you help us build a well? 
Will you help sponsor a well? Will you join with us in helping us to provide safe, clean drinking water to a thirsty world that's searching and hoping that they might have a better life and a better lifestyle? We can help them to have that. We can help them to have the most precious possession that we have Besides the Lord Jesus Christ as our personal Savior, we can help provide fresh, safe drinking water by working together to provide a well. Please call us right now and let us know how you might help. You can make a contribution of any amount, a pledge of any amount, and we'll work together to provide safe, clean drinking water. You can help us build a well in a third world country in Africa. Call us right now. Let us hear from you. 812-858-3920. That's 812-858-3920. And partner with us as we provide safe drinking water to people in third world countries. It is incredibly easy for us to go to the tap for a glass of water, but not for these African children. Water is necessary for the existence of life. Finding water is especially difficult in this arid climate. The young, middle-aged, and old alike are on a daily quest to find a safe, reliable source for water. No one is exempt from the search. They need for you and me working together to supply life's most precious natural resource, a well that will yield safe, fresh water. Do you have running water in your home? Share what has so graciously been given to you and help us bless others. Together we can meet this very real, very physical need. Help us build water wells. Call right now, 812-858-3920. Please don't delay. The children and their families are counting on us. What we need for you to do right now is pick up the telephone and call us at 1-812-858-3920 and make your most generous contribution of any amount. Put it on your credit or debit card so that we'll have the resources to move forward in building these safe, fresh water wells. Can you imagine every day of your existence you get up and the only thing that you can do that day is to go look for some clean water for your family, safe water for your children. Oftentimes it's the children going and, and walking miles looking for safe, fresh water. Mothers spending every day of their existence in search of water for their families. If they have water in their village, these women can go to school. Uh, they can take care of their families. Uh, they can start businesses if they want to. But they can do other productive things besides spending their entire day walking miles and carrying water back home. And oftentimes the water is even unsafe to drink. We can put a safe, fresh water well in their village so that they can become productive citizens, so that they can have life-giving water right in their community. That's why we need for you to help us and partner with us by giving your most generous gift of $50 or $100 or $25 or $1,000, whatever you can give. And we can work together to build these safe, fresh water wells. We saw several villages while we were in the northern part of South Africa, Dambali, Chiriri, and the village Dr. Maxwell grew up in. These villages and many, many more have a great need for safe, fresh water, something that you and I, all of us, take for granted mm. every single day Absolutely. of our lives. It's water. We think it's just water. It's more than water. Yeah. As Dr. Maxwell said, water is life to these people. If you recall earlier in the program, there was a clip of a little girl dressed in pink, very small little girl, very small wheelbarrow, her name is Esther. Esther is no more than seven years old, and she had the responsibility that day, and I'm certain many other days, taking her wheelbarrow over dusty roads in bare feet, walking for miles to find safe, fresh water. And she's lucky to find safe, fresh water. Sometimes there isn't water to be found. Sometimes the water that's found is dangerous. The water causes outbreaks of cholera and all kinds of other diseases, and we're talking life and death situations here. What I'm asking you to do, what I'm begging you to do, and what we're begging you to do is to help us help Esther and the tens of thousands of children 
and mothers and families and villages and communities that Esther represents. Help us to help them. If the Lord has blessed you, and I know if he's in your heart, he has. If the Lord has blessed you, help us to bless others. Help us to bless Esther and the people like her. Help us provide safe, fresh water. If you give a cup of cold water in the name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, it will come back to you. Yes. Please call us right now at 812-858-3920 and make your most generous contribution. Together, we can give safe, fresh water to a village that doesn't have any water and we can save lives. God bless you. The blessing is yours. We are now at the end of our broadcast. Operators are still standing by. Work with us to provide safe, fresh water wells. Call 812-858-3920. Partner with us to give life. Turn your 